So here's the thing. The video you're about to see is a video I filmed much earlier in this week, and it's basically me making fun of Vladimir Putin and the Russian government by prank calling actual Russian government offices. This was all filmed before the horrific invasion that we're seeing right now in Ukraine by Russia. And like a day after things started going down and watching what's happening on the news and like pure shock and sadness, one of my thoughts was it's not the right time for me to be posting my regular like silly goofy content. But at the same time, I recognize that I have this platform platform and I have the ability and I really just want to use it to help out in a way that's just not reposting an infographic on my Instagram story. So I realized one thing I can do is post this video and use it as a platform to not only spread awareness and provide resources for ways you can help Ukraine, but as you can see on the sides of this video, this video is a fundraiser for the charity called Save the Children. They are currently on the ground in Ukraine and they need as many donations as they can get because right now, out of all the civilians that are in danger in Ukraine, over 7 million of them are children. I don't like asking you guys to do things, but if you're able to, I would really appreciate it if you can make a donation. I'll be contributing a thousand dollars from the ad revenue from this video so even if you can't donate you're still contributing now we'll start the video in just a second but i just want to say there's lots and lots and lots of resources linked below please go check them out and also i want to be super super clear that all the jokes in the video that you're about to see are being made at vladimir putin at the russian government and not at the people of russia or ukraine they are all victims in this situation okay this video is crazy i don't know how else to put it here's me prank calling literally the russian government enjoy You may be wondering how I'm literally on the phone with Russia's equivalent of the White House. Well, here's how. Anonymous hacked Russia's official websites and contact points, so I used a website that takes older snapshots of the website. And through there, I got this. Oh, information. Okay, contacts. <gasps> no way it was that easy. <laughs> Um, and by the way, these are all just casually the information phones of the presidential executive office. Let's give the presidential executive office a call. So for Russian numbers, you have to dial 011. And we're gonna pray that works. I don't know, I've never called Russia! Why would I call Russia? Uh, do you speak English? Listen up. I need you to put on your supervisor. Bosom. I need you to listen up right now. See, si, senorita, put that on. Do you love it when I call you, senorita? Bark for me. Wait, say that again. Say that again. What was that? Что это было? Do you watch Mr. Beast? She hung up! I have no clue what she said, but y'all saw the translations. So, next! Brilliant. Have you seen Vladimir Putin land at the airport? Uh, we are working. To stop him? No, no, no. We are working. Oh, I'm working too. I'm working to take him down. Take down the whole Kremlin. You feel me? Basically, what I'm saying is, like, if you see his, his like, plane landing and it's, like, Vladimir Putin, just accidentally redirect it into the ocean and see what happens. Just for, like, a little funny meme. For London. Flight for London. What flight? Uh, do you want... To know about life to London. London? To London. No? You want me to go to London? You want to know about flight to London? No, I want to know what flight Putin's on. Vladimir Putin. What's the flight? Uh, Vladimir Putin <laughs> Airlines VV123. One, two, three. Ready? Yeah. This flight. 
Vladimir Putin Airlines. Don't forget that part. What's the country? What's the country? Um, Russia. Russia. Okay. 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 Ok